If you struggle with shyness or social anxiety, check out our free no BS training course with actual useful advice you can do from home. None of that just get out there nonsense. The link is in the description below. For now, let's get to today's question. The question, how does it feel to have social anxiety and not feel good enough? You feel like you don't fit in, that no one wants to talk to you. You feel like an alien that is unable to assimilate and blend in. When going to a social event you have to make yourself go. Everything is awkward. Everything's an overthought task. Where to sit, who to talk to, what to say, what not to say, how long to talk, when to break away. An occasion that is supposed to be enjoyable becomes a grueling mission to be completed. When it gets too much you go to the restroom, wet your hands and face with cold water, try to compose yourself, then go back out to awkwardly suffer through until it's time to go home. If sometimes you think you pulled it off and appeared normal, until you get home and the anxiety sets in that you made a fool of yourself and everyone thinks you're an oddball. Even though most people are too selfish to be bothered, you feel like everyone is somehow aware of you and would rather you buzz off. Somehow I assimilated, made friends, participated, contributed and was valued. But it was hard work, being careful to put myself in situations I excelled in, avoiding situations of failure. I'm in my 50s now and really don't care as much about what others think. I mostly only talk with those of my faith, for some reason I don't feel judged. Sometimes people even like talking with me but I, don't like it and move on as soon as polite. Find more answers and a free audiobook on how to talk to anyone in the description below. No useless advice like just get out there I mean actual useful advice from people who have really dealt with shyness and social anxiety and overcome it in their own lives.